Over the last several years, I've made a point to make a visit to Central California during harvest. And recently, I attended the World Ag Expo in Tulare, California, and I will tell you, it gave me a chance to talk to some of the manufacturers. And I spoke with Don Mayo, the president of Orchard Machinery Company, and Don was really excited to share some of their new technology. Where a tree shaker historically was a really simple machine, over the last several years, it's got very sophisticated. They have a system now that's called Tree Seeker. It still requires an operator, but the machine will move through the orchard, come up along where a tree is, the operator will push a button and everything else is automatic. The head will extend, it'll grasp the tree, it shakes, releases, and moves to the next tree where that process is repeated. The interesting part about the technology that really got my attention was when Don explained to me the sophistication in the rubber rolls that shake the tree. It's not as simple as you might think. Those are air-filled, and they pay a close attention to the frequency of what tree they're shaking. And as you can see in this illustration, those air-filled rubber rolls really grab the tree very well compared to older systems that don't have the technology. And as I talk to producers, I've learned that operators of machinery can really damage these trees. Upwards of 5 to 10% of the orchard can receive some damage from an operator not paying attention. And this new automation is certainly poised to fix that. Don invited me out this harvest season to show some new autonomous stuff they're working on as well, and I can't wait. Reporting on technology for This Week in Agribusiness, I'm Chad Colby.